In Japan, Kaiten Sushi is a popular dining experience known for its convenience, efficiency and affordability. And this is Kaiten Sushi Ginza Onodera, a location in Tokyo created by the world-famous Ginza Onodera restaurant group. With multiple high-end sushi omakase locations that have won Michelin acclaim over the years, this is their attempt to provide their style of sushi in a more casual and affordable setting. And the result is honestly a bit peculiar, as it is likely some of the best kaiten sushi in Tokyo regarding sushi quality. But the odd part is, it's not quite kaiten sushi at all in the literal sense, as the conveyor belt is certainly present, but it doesn't seem to be in use anymore. Nevertheless, it's hard to disagree that this spot serves exceptional sushi and lives up to the prestigious Ginza Onodera brand. That said, this kaiten sushi spot might not be for everyone, but we'll cover the pros and cons and provide a detailed piece by piece breakdown so you can decide if it's worth adding to your Tokyo itinerary. So as mentioned prior, this lovely conveyor belt you see before you never actually gets used. Instead, everything is made to order via iPad, which is typical for most traditional conveyor belt sushi restaurants. In fact, this is my preferred and recommended method, regardless of the conveyor belt's functionality, as it ensures each piece of sushi is fresh and made to order. And herein lies this spot's most notable strength. The sushi here is impeccably fresh, high quality, and frankly, above the general standards you'd expect from the average kaiten establishment. A clear example of this is their featuring of Yamayuki Bluefin Tuna, an esteemed bluefin tuna wholesaler, renowned for its exceptional sourcing, particularly across high-end sushi restaurants. Their strict and meticulous selection criteria ensures that the tuna supplied is of exceptional quality, characterized by its rich, buttery flavor and tender texture. Another unique and delightful quirk that distinguishes this from other Kaiten sushi restaurants is their lively and performative atmosphere, where the chefs will announce and showcase the fresh ingredients for all to see. Directly afterwards, customers have the option to order the showcased sushi, which is a fun and interactive way to choose the chef's freshest daily recommendations. And while every piece here exceeded expectations, these were some of the standouts. This horse mackerel was a testament to Onodera's superb fish quality. While horse mackerel can sometimes be a bit fishy, this was clean, nuanced, and full of decadent oily umami that was perfectly balanced by fresh ginger and green onion. Seared ingawa, which is a cut near the fin of the flounder, has a buttery yet delicate texture, with a pleasant crispness on the outside from the searing, balanced by a melt-in-your-mouth richness from its natural fat content. And while the Yamayuki bluefin tuna mentioned earlier was delicious across all of the different cuts, it was actually the salmon here that was most memorable. The salmon belly cut has a higher fat content and delivers an indulgent flavor with a natural sweetness. The incredibly soft and tender texture basically melts in your mouth, leaving a lingering, savory richness on the palate. But despite the unanimously delicious sushi, I don't think this place is for everyone, as there's one factor that can't be ignored. The prices are simply higher across the board. And while I believe you get what you pay for in terms of authentic, freshly made Idomai sushi, worthy of the Ginza Onodera brand, it's ultimately a premium experience with proportionately premium pricing. But if you don't mind paying a bit extra, this is a one-of-a-kind kaiten spot where you can experience superb higher-end sushi in a casual, convenient, and lively atmosphere. Thanks for watching, and until next time, cheers.